My comfort index for today, highest it's been all week, a 9 out of 10. And the reason for that calm wind, partly to mostly sunny sky and highs that are going to dance around 60 degrees by late in the afternoon. Now we do have to talk about rain percentages increasing for this weekend. Make sure your peeps have the umbrella handy at times as we go throughout this Easter holiday weekend. For Saturday, we're going to see the rain mainly confined to the morning hours before 10 a.m. That's right, Future Track has now bumped up the exit time for our rain. Looks like the bulk of the rain should end by around 10 a.m. Saturday morning. And then we go dry for Saturday afternoon. Regarding Easter Sunday, Future Track now, though, has tried to increase the rain percentages late in the day. We're talking after 4 or 5 p.m. that those percentages are going to uptick for Easter Sunday. So let's go hour by hour with all of this in a brand new run of future trap. We're going to stay dry for this Friday and our thick clouds. Those will build on in later on this evening. We're talking after six, seven o'clock. That's when you're going to notice that the sky really going gray back again across to the area and eventually that's going to give way to the waterworks returning overnight. Here we are paused just after midnight at 1 a.m. Saturday morning and we're going to have to contend with some nice steady rain overnight. Some great sleeping weather for many of you. Maybe a quick rumble or two of thunder, but no type of severe weather, nothing like that. And again, we're going to be looking at the waterworks still around towards daybreak Saturday morning. Here we are paused at 7 a.m. But watch closely this run of future track. I want to first alert you that by 10 11 a.m. We're going to see the bulk of the rain exiting the area. Maybe just a stray pop up shower late in the day into the afternoon hours for Saturday, uh, but certainly after 10 AM, it's certainly looking a lot quieter than earlier forecasts uh, were suggesting with the data. So that is good news for any outdoor plans or Easter egg hunts. Heading on into the holiday itself for Easter Sunday. Here we are paused at 7 AM times of sun and clouds temperature right around 40 degrees, but no rain showing on up and we're going to have to wait until late in the day before we have to try to worry about any type of showers increasing after about four or five o'clock in the afternoon as we're going to see some of those rain percentages starting to uptick again across the parts of Michiana. And that trend is going to give way to an active period as we head towards next week. I want to first alert you on our 10 day forecast that we're going to have some active weather headed our way early next week. We're talking Monday, Tuesday right on into Wednesday, Monday, Tuesday. You'll notice that we have that thunderbolt icon around. We're going to have some scattered showers and thunderstorms that are going to increase across the area, bringing with it some pockets of heavy rain. In fact, we could be looking at over an inch of water between Monday and Tuesday, and then enough cold air comes into play that by Wednesday, could have to contend with a few snowflakes flying into the air. Now, after I've already given you that emotional roller coaster <laughs> right there, look at the far <laughs> right hand corner of your screen. I redeem myself yes, near you 70 next weekend. <laughs> you finished strong. Thank you, Andrew. All right, coming up, there is a lot of Easter fun to enjoy this weekend. We're going to share a couple of the big events happening in communities right here in Michiana. Plus, maybe you're